This is a really exciting £34 million regeneration project for Canesham being delivered by Bath and North East Somerset Council. It's going to secure 600 jobs in the town which is great for its economic future and prosperity. It's providing great facilities for the people of Canesham and it's also going to be improving the public realm and the highway uh, system around the town. We've been on site for a year now and we're on schedule for completion in a year's time. It's been great working with our partners, Wilmot Dixon. The most complicated part is definitely the site logistics. We're right in the middle of Cainsham Town Centre. It's very important that we manage our deliveries effectively so that we don't clog up the site and that we can lift everything we need into the right locations. Even before we appointed an architect, we had a group of uh, community leaders from uh, town councils to business associations to youth leaders to find out what their aspirations were for this. Uh, they set some of the remit for the uh, architects, they've been involved all the way through. We've done lots of community engagement um, with various groups across Cainsham, from the youth groups doing graffiti projects to getting involved with food co-ops, open doors events, so we've really tried to engage the community. We're now on the first floor of the Library One Stop Shop. We're actually standing in the new community space, able to hold anything from a local cinema to council town meetings to gym classes and local dance facilities, so great asset for Cainsham. Very much a modern, relaxing library, opportunities for different zones, for children's area, teenage areas, reference areas, but also soft seating, uh, cafe, able to people to meet and relax. The one-stop shop is really building on the experience we've had in Bath. It will be an area where you can come and meet multiple different uh, partner organisations as well as the council. So anything from renewing your bus pass, paying your council tax, querying something with, with the council or any other partner organisation. Very much a hub for community facilities. Behind me on my left shoulder is the main retail space. There's about 20,000 square foot of retail, a mixture of uh, small and medium and large type retail units, up to 15 individual shops, but very flexible. Really important for the regeneration case here is that we brought new and exciting retail facilities for Cainsham, adding to the sense of excitement and vitality of the high street. The main materials we're using on the building are white lias up to ground floor level, ground to first floor is blue lias, which again is another local vernacular stone, and then above it will be brass cladding, picking up some of the heritage in Cainsham. We've got solar panels going on the roofs of the main offices and also um, on top of the car park, um, and they'll obviously feed electricity um, back into the building for, for use for the offices and for the civic centre. This building is all about trying to minimise the energy consumption. Really important aspect this for the council. We wanted to show community leadership and also benefit for our ratepayers and taxpayers of Bath and North and Somerset. The Civic Centre car park, with the existing car park, is being completely refurbished when we complete the uh, development in uh, August, September 14.